Hello everyone, Rafael here, amigos, Rafael. So, here we have, as you can see, Darth Vader. Aquí tenemos a Darth Vader. This was done by DMD, Dynamic Menace Designs. And all I can say is, wow. I mean, as you all know, I have the Cinemaquette Darth Vader one-third scale, which to me, well, you know, I mean, it was the ultimate uh, number one piece to have. And it still is, uh, because I love the fact that you can take the helmet apart and you have the silicone head, you have the uh, uh, James Earl Jones original voice, the sound effects, just amazing piece. But I was never really a super fan of the pose. I'm always, uh, I'm always a fan of museum poses. Uh, como saben, tengo el Vader de Cinema Cat, que me encanta, el número uno. Uh, pero, you know, nunca fui tan fan de la pose que tiene, pero es increíble por la cabeza de silicón y lo, el, el sonido que tiene, más la voz original de, de James Earl Jones. But this one here, as you can see, I have two. This is a one-third scale. Tengo dos, un tercio escala y un cuarto, and one-quarter scale. And I had to get both because this one is my grandson's. Este es para mi nieto. Uh, but I need to show you this. It's, uh, it's amazing. They only did 25 of these. Solo hicieron 25 de estos and 35 of those. Y 35 de estos. And here they are. Uh, I mean, it's just amazing. Realmente es increíble. Very great presence. And it comes with switch out arms, so you can switch different poses. También viene con diferentes brazos para ponerlos en diferente pos. O no sé cómo se diga. So let's uh, do the change arms, so you can see. So let's uh, change the arms. I'm going to do the arms on this guy because it's a lot easier because it's smaller. Voy a cambiar los brazos en ese porque es más fácil, porque está más chico. Uh, one thing. The lightsaber on this guy did come broken, so I'm expecting another one. And, and este se le está quebrado el lightsaber, así que espero otra. But this one works, so you'll get an idea of what it looks like. So let's start changing the arms. Vamos a cambiar los brazos. One thing very uh, quick here. The light switch is right back here. La luz para prenderlo está aquí. This one here is a little bit hard to get to. You have to take the belt off. Esto se tiene que quitar el, el cinturón. Because it's behind here. Uh, the switch is behind this guy here. Same with this one. You can kind of get in here a little bit. But uh, it would have been nice if it had it maybe down here. Si hubiera estado más fácil si tuviera el switch aquí abajito. But either way. So here you have the lightsaber here. Which is cool. That's why the hand is like that. Aquí tienen el lightsaber. So that's nice. Take this off. You have this look. Which I'm not a fan of because you can't see the lights. Uh, también está este look, pero no me gusta porque se bloquean las luces. Also, uh, these blink, so it's kind of cool. And you have this pose. También tienen esta posición. Here's the other one. Aquí está el otro. And again, you have the same switch out arms for the one third scale. De nuevo, tienen los mismos brazos para el, el grandote. And of course, you have the pointing one. Y tienen este, which is pretty cool. But I would be uh, displaying him with the lightsaber. Yo lo voy a poner con el lightsaber because that is crazy looking. And you will see right now. Uh, also, I like this pose very much. También me encanta mucho esta pose. So this may be, uh, you know, I'll put these arms behind the display just uh, to have them and put everything else away. But my main concern here is having a lightsaber, which is a pose I prefer. But this is the second pose I would use. Esta es la segunda pose que tal vez lo, lo pondría aparte uh, con su, su la saber. So let's get the saber on this guy. And here's the saber connection, 
which you have the button here that will turn on these lights. El botón eso va a prender las dos estas and the saber. Now these guys are very fragile, so be very careful. So muy frágiles, así que hay que tener cuidado. Now this is what it looks like with a saber. Now let's turn it on. I'm going to close these uh, curtains to make it a little bit darker. Vamos a cerrar las cortes para que esté un poco más oscuro. All right, so here we go, my friends. Aquí vamos. Look at that. It's almost got fleas. Alguien tiene pulgas. All right, so there you go. I mean, look at that. I mean, just look at this. Amazing. I just love this museum pose. Me encanta este pose de museo. Again, guys, I think this one, I mean, it's like having, especially if you have this one, the one-third scales. He tiene este. I mean, he is amazing and he is such a presence. Tiene una presencia increíble. Of course, the helmet is one piece and what's kind of nice is that una pieza. you can you know turn it a bit so that's kind of cool you know well there you have it my friends amazing pieces and I got so lucky, tuve mucha suerte. This piece is number one. Oh man, so cool. Anyways, if you got these, congratulations. If you don't estos, muchas felicidades. Because they are, of course, all sold out. Porque claro, ya están todos vendidos. All right, till next time, amigos. Hasta la próxima.